I study classics for two reasons. The first for the experience. I study classics, long story short, because I love it. I study classics because I love it. And the second for the content itself, having that perspective into history. It all boils down to the fact that I find it truly fascinating. I'm studying the classics because all of the classes are absolutely amazing and super engaging. There's really not a dull moment. I studied the classics because it's cool to understand dead languages. I study classics because I love language. I love learning about cultures through the analysis of language. I study Latin initially because I'm interested in history. I originally studied the classics and got into the classics because I loved ancient Greek plays. I'm not sure if there's any one reason why I study classics, but something that encouraged me to continue studying classics was seeing how similar we are to people who lived thousands of years ago, how their anxieties are our anxieties. I study classics because I get to study everything. Given everything that's happening in our world right now, I think classics can be a bit of an escape, but it can also help us to see beyond our own experiences and to contextualize what's happening right now. I have a very distinct memory of walking into my first intro pre class at the beginning of my first semester, first year, and just knowing that like the game had changed. I would register for classics courses again and again because I knew that even if I felt scared and uncertain at the beginning, those feelings would be replaced with a rewarding sense of accomplishment. I think we have the best professors on campus. You can't come out of being guided through Thucydides by Professor Cummins or learning texts in their original ancient Greek with Professor Dixon. You can't come out of those experiences without some newfound view on the world. The department, faculty, and students, you learn a lot from them. Every single class is engaging and challenging, and the students in the classics department make class even better. And being able to engage in such an intellectual environment and surrounded by peers who share the same passion as you is amazing. In all the classic classes I've been in at Grinnell, the attitude of the class and the professor has just been, you know, we're happy to be here and we're happy to have you. I find the precision of Greek and Latin to be challenging, rewarding, frustrating at times, but so liberating. I love learning languages, and that's what first brought me to classics. And learning ancient Greek and Latin have gone on to help me learn modern Greek and Spanish and a tiny bit of Korean. This language is still used in modern day biology, like in mycology, the study of fungi. Whenever a new species is discovered, its original or initial publication should always provide a detailed description of the species written in Latin. There is no better way to freak out your friends than by chanting at them in Latin. Super fun. Learning Latin allows me to read a lot of Asian texts in their original language, which provides me with more intricate insights than reading a translation would have. And I also love mythology. I love stories. I love reading the stories and the tales that the ancients faced. And I recall learning about a gravestone, upon which was an epitaph written in the voice of the deceased, who asks that we don't mourn for him because he doesn't have to worry about paying rent or having enough to eat anymore. And I also love all the lessons that they've passed down to us. Seeing how those in the ancient world dealt with similar problems can be encouraging to us. The rhetorical devices developed thousands of years ago in Latin writing are still valid and greatly appreciated in today's academic writing as well. Now that I'm thinking about law school, I really appreciate most of all the way that classics has helped me engage in critical dialogue with primary and with secondary texts and then develop my own thoughts from those texts and really bring something new to the table. 
Classics combine so many different disciplines that are all equally necessary and important that it never feels like I've chosen to study just one thing. Classics, Classics allows us to study everything. Is mythology. From is language, language and linguistics to history, history and literature and politics to art. art and archaeology and architecture. Studying classics allows me to combine all of my interests. Ancient philosophy, philosophy art, and history, history, drama, and shit literature, etc. I've learned a lot about history and politics and philosophy through the lens of these ancient texts. I have studied in classics classes everything from foundational principles of philosophy, of science, and maybe even of architecture and be able to uncover the humanities underlying those and combine them is an invaluable process. It's also a super like interesting blend of language and history and art and architecture that all works together to paint this picture. To begin painting this beautiful picture of the ancient world, of the lives that the ancients lived. I really think that classics is the ultimate way to experience the liberal arts. And I think that a study of classics aligns with the college's mission statement, which is to think clearly, to speak and write persuasively, to evaluate critically our own ideas and the ideas of others. I feel like classics has guided me through my college experience in a really profound way thus far. And so I had no idea getting into the classics what type of legitimate, profound impact it would have on my time here at Grinnell and just my everyday life. I'm just so grateful to have grown so much through the classics, both at Grinnell and abroad in Greece, and to have so much support and encouragement from the classics faculty. And then since I'm also a biology major, I, re I gradually realized that there are more commonalities between uh, Latin learning and biology studying. Problems that we're dealing with are longstanding and how we go about handling them is very much informed by the ancient world. And the essence of Latin learning and biology studying are the same in that they both require the process of questioning, hypothesizing, and testing. So learning both Latin and biology provide me with a fresh perspective for both subjects that learning any one of them would not have. Too often we regard history as irrelevant, but in reality it was very much like our own. And it raises plenty of difficult questions about ourselves and forces us to confront them head on. And I've had a lot of fun getting to relate the stories and the narratives that are in ancient texts to my own culture. I think that's something that I didn't think I was going to get to do in my studies at Grinnell, and I'm really grateful that Classics has allowed me that window to connect myself to my work in a really amazing and beautiful way. Learning the history, language, and culture of ancient Greece and Rome, the way it is taught at Grinnell, is so utterly engaging that deciding to major in Classics it was hardly a difficult choice. Every new day and every new passage is a challenge. And honestly, I wouldn't have it any other way. It has been maybe the greatest choice that I've made here at Grinnell to study and major in classics. No son de espero, me de no lo supo. Rosoli rones ti posen, tote lo so chronos apeti. No son de espero, me de no lo supo. Rosoli rones ti posen, tote lo so chronos apeti.